here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Good morning. Time now is 8:16. We have the clouds around, some fog, and we had some overnight rain as well. And now that's kind of pulling away from our area, so we're getting a little bit of a break from the steady rain uh, for this morning. But we have more rain on the way. Uh, some of it heavy at times later on today. Taking a look outside, it's just a dreary day. The clouds in place, the fog, and it's a cool start as well. We, our winds have been off, the, you know, off the cooler waters all weekend long, so it's just been kind of that damp and raw feeling outside. Visibility right now. Uh, pretty low across a good chunk of the area, less than a mile in Newport, about two miles in Providence, same deal in Smithfield, about two and a half, Taunton, two miles as well. So no matter where you are, the fog is uh, pretty dense out there. So take it slow on the roadways if you are traveling anytime this morning. Temperatures right now are pretty much in the lower 50s. We're going to top out between about 55 and uh, 60 degrees for later on today. Wind gusts not too bad out there right now locally, but out towards the Cape and the islands, they are gusting between about 20 and 30 miles per hour. I do expect the, the winds to pick up uh, for later on today and tonight, along with that heavy rain as well. So my three key things, the break in the rain this morning, that's what we're seeing, which is some mist and drizzle around. The steadiest rain though arrives later on today and into this evening, some of it heavy at times. Good news is, though, we dry things out in time for the new work week as well as the new month of May starting tomorrow. Live radar again shows just some leftover light showers and drizzle and mist across our area. The heaviest uh, rain that we saw overnight is now pulling away and well into the uh, Gulf of Maine away from our area. However, we have more rain to go. We're not done yet. We're not out of the woods. And uh, you can see some moisture to the south here at the bottom of your screen. This is all going to be streaming up to us for later on today and into tonight. So again, we have a lot more wet weather to get through before we finally see some sunshine return for Monday. The wide view shows low pressure to our south along with a warm front. Lots of moisture streaming up into southern New England. So uh, we're in for it for the rest of today. Some clouds, some fog, some rain. We got all of it coming our way. You can see we're going to time it out for you the rest of today. Through this morning, some lighter showers around lunchtime, but the heaviest stuff doesn't arrive until later on this afternoon and this evening, indicated by those, you know, yellows, oranges, and reds on the screen. That's those heavier downpours scattered about, so it's not going to be, you know, heavy nonstop, but certainly at times going to be heavier uh, with some thunder and even some lightning at times as well. So a messy, stormy end to our weekend. Eight o'clock tonight, you can see those reds making their way through from time to time. Same deal all the way into the overnight hours as well. That last batch uh, that we're watching later on around midnight to about one o'clock in the morning, some heavier rainfall making its way through. That should do it in terms of the rainfall. It should pull everything away with it and uh, we'll dry and clear things out for Monday morning with sunshine returning finally. But it will be windy on Monday too, so it'll be nicer in terms of sky conditions, but the wind will also make it feel cooler at times. This morning's forecast, let's recap it. Cloudy, some sprinkles around, showers, temperatures near 57 by about lunchtime. And then for this afternoon again, showers give way to a steadier, heavier rain as we go through the evening hours. Temperatures topping out right around 60 degrees. But again, when the wind's coming off of the cooler waters, it's not going to feel all that nice out there. So it's going to be feeling pretty raw, actually, for the rest of today. Here's that seven-day forecast for you. Again, we have just the rest of today and tonight to get through this messy weather. We have some nicer weather in store for Monday, temperatures in the 60s, but keep in mind it will be windy. And then some clouds and some more showers in the seven day forecast for the middle part of the week. Temperatures slightly below the average. We should be around 61 degrees. We'll be in the 50s to around 60 degrees uh, over the next seven days. Of course, get this full forecast on our website at any time, WPRI.com. Well, it looks like though that break in the rain this morning will give you enough time to go to the autism walk in Warwick, yes. walk your dog, not Get talking outside. to anyone I know in particular, <laughs> but if someone is home with the dog, maybe, you know, later this morning, there's a good time mm. to walk though. It is a good time to walk. Definitely get outside, run the <laughs> errands uh, because later on tonight, heavy rain moves in. All right. Thanks, Steven. All right. The Mortgage Bankers Association.